How about this? Simply, President Trump is a total and complete dipshit. Now, you see, I would never say these things, at least not in a public address, but someone else would. Someone like Jordan Peele. This is a dangerous time. It's like an arms race, right? You have a generator that tries to generate uh, some images in the beginning, you know, it's just like some random pixels. But then what you try to do is you tell, instead of telling it where to improve, like traditional supervised learning, you just tell it, no, it's not good enough. So you would improve and improve again until the, you would fool the discriminator so that the discriminator can't tell anymore what a difference is and then itself improves. This kind of facial recognition technology has been around for a long time. It's even been used in major movies like Star Wars Rogue One, which is a prequel to a film that came out almost 40 years before it. It's also been used in the Fast and the Furious series, when Paul Walker died during the production of Fast and the Furious 7, and that his face onto his brother's body so that they were able to complete the film. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.